Throughout maritime history, there have been numerous epic tales of grand vessels meeting tragic ends as they succumbed to the unforgiving depths of the ocean. From the thunderous battleships that once ruled the seas to the opulent liners that promised luxury and adventure, each of these colossal vessels met a dramatic and tragic end beneath the waves. Join us on a voyage into the past as we uncover the stories of the 10 biggest ships ever to meet their watery graves. This list is based on displacement, so without further delay, let's get started. A big shout out to Private Internet Access for sponsoring today's video. In today's digital world, your personal information is constantly at risk. Hackers, ISPs, and even governments can track your every move online, but VPN is a solution. A VPN hides your IP address and encrypts your internet connection, protecting your online activities from being viewed by third parties. The world's best VPN provider today is Private Internet Access, which has over 30 million downloads. It was established with the aim of offering individuals a secure and private online browsing experience. Picture this. Browsing online without private internet access is like writing a personal letter on a postcard for everyone to read, while using PIA is like sealing that letter in an envelope and sending it securely, ensuring only the intended recipient can access its contents. Also, are you tired of browsing the internet with restrictions, yearning for a world with unlimited possibilities? Guess what? The incredible Harry Potter series is missing from the US Netflix library. But fear not, with private internet access, a whole new streaming universe awaits. Just a click away, you can transport yourself to Netflix Japan or Netflix Australia. Unlock endless entertainment with PIA. Protect unlimited devices simultaneously with a single PIA subscription. For a limited time, sign up now to enjoy an incredible 83% discount on your subscription, plus get 4 months completely free. Don't miss out on this unbeatable deal. Take control of your streaming experience with private internet access. The 10th biggest ship to have ever sunk is the USS Lexington CV-2. She was one of the two Lexington-class aircraft carriers in the US Navy and was put into service in 1928. During World War II, she suffered significant damage from two torpedoes and three aerial bombs launched by the Japanese. After fuel explosions, the ship was abandoned and scuttled by the USS Phelps, marking the first loss of a US Navy aircraft carrier in the war. The wreck was discovered by Petrol Team on March 4, 2018, over 500 miles away from the coast of Queensland. The shipwreck is now divided into several pieces on the ocean floor. The USS Lexington had a length of 270.7 meters and a maximum displacement of 48,500 tons. Moving on to the ninth biggest sunken ship, we have the Costa Concordia. This cruise ship, operated by Costa Concierge, struck a rock in the Tyrrhenian Sea near Isola del Giglio on January 13, 2012. This led to a 50-meter gash on the port side of the hull, causing flooding in the engine room and cutting power to the ship. As a result, 32 people lost their lives among the 3,229 passengers. The Costa Concordia had a length of 290.20 meters and a displacement of about 50,000 tons. She was among the largest ship built in Italy until the construction of the Dream-class cruise ships. The eighth largest shipwreck is that of the Bismarck. A powerful battleship built for Nazi Germany's Kriegsmarine during World War II, it faced an intense attack from British forces, including 16 ferry swordfish biplane torpedo bombers, two battleships, and two heavy cruisers, resulting in its sinking due to shelling, torpedo strikes, and scuttling. Robert Ballard discovered the wreck in June 1989. The Bismarck had a length of 251 meters and a maximum displacement of 50,300 tons. Next at number 7 is the RMS Titanic, a British passenger liner operated by the White Star Line, which tragically sank in the North Atlantic Ocean on April 15, 1912 after hitting an iceberg on its maiden voyage from Southampton to New York City. It remains one of the deadliest maritime disasters with over 1,500 lives lost among the estimated 2,224 passengers and crew. The Titanic was the largest ship afloat at the time, 
with a displacement of about 52,310 tons and a length of 268 meters. At number 6, we have the Tirpitz. She was a Bismarck-class battleship of the Kriegsmarine of Nazi Germany. During World War II, she engaged with British Navy in a battle. She sank quickly after being hit by two direct hits and a near miss from British Lancaster bombers, carrying 12,000-pound Tallboy bombs on November 12, 1944. The wreck was subsequently broken up between 1948 and 1957 in a salvage operation conducted jointly by Norway and Germany. The Turbid was the largest battleship constructed by a European fleet, with a displacement of 52,600 tons and a length of 251 meters. At number 5 is the HMHS Britannic, belonging to White Star Line's Olympic class of steamships and serving in the Royal Navy. Design changes made during construction due to lessons learned from the sinking of the Titanic. She sank near the Greek island of Kia after hitting a naval mine laid by the Imperial Japanese Navy on November 21, 1916, resulting in the loss of 30 lives out of the 1,066 people on board. The wreck was explored by Jack Hosto in 1975 and remains the largest intact passenger ship on the seabed. The Britannic had a displacement of about 53,200 tons and a length of 269.1 meters. At number 4 is the Shinano. She was an aircraft carrier built by the Imperial Japanese Navy during World War II, the largest such built up to that time. She was sunk en route 10 days after commissioning. She holds the distinction of being the largest warship ever sunk by a submarine after being hit by four torpedoes from the American Navy submarine Archer Fish on November 29, 1944, resulting in the loss of 1,435 lives, including the captain. She was the largest warship built up to that time. She displaced 69,151 tons and had a length of 265.8 meters. Up next is a Japanese battleship Musashi. She was one of four planned Yamato-class battleships. She was sunk during the Battle of Leyte Gulf on October 24, 1944 after sustaining numerous hits from American carrier-based aircraft. The wreck was discovered in March 2015 by a group of researchers hired by Paul Allen, the co-founder of Microsoft. The Musashi had a displacement of 72,809 tons and a length of 263 meters. At number 2 is again the Japanese battleship Yamato. She was the lead ship of a class of battleships built for the Imperial Japanese Navy. She and her sister ship Musashi were the heaviest and most powerfully armed battleships ever constructed. On April 7, 1945, the Yamato sank during a fierce battle for Okinawa. The Yamato was discovered 180 miles southwest of Kyushu, one of Japan's major islands in the 1980s by shipwreck hunters. The ship was discovered in pieces at a depth of 340 meters or 1,120 feet. Like her sister ship Musashi, the Yamato had a displacement of 72,809 tons and a length of 263 meters. And now the biggest, largest sunken ship in history is none other than USS America CV-66. This supercarrier was one of three Kitty Hawk-class carriers built for the United States Navy in the 1960s. Following her retirement, the U.S. Navy tested USS America with submerged explosive, watching from afar, and through monitoring devices placed on the vessel. On May 14, 2005, America was sunk in a controlled scuttling once the test was finished. She was sunk around 250 miles southeast of Cape Hatteras. The wreck lies upright in one piece, 5,140 meters, or 16,860 feet below the surface of the Atlantic Ocean. She had a length of 319 meters and a displacement of 84,914 tons when fully loaded. 